Hi again, welcome back to the fourth installment of this Circle Theorem series, where I'm aiming to prove all five Circle Theorems. Now this one's really interesting, it's the case where we've got a cyclic quadrilateral inside our circle, such that the points of the quadrilateral lie on the circumference. And that's what it sort of means. So, let's take a look at our Circle Theorem. It says opposite angles in a cyclic quadrilateral add up to 180 degrees. And again, we're going to be making use of Circle Theorem 1. So if you haven't seen the previous videos, the link to the playlist will be below and they're also on my channel. So go ahead and watch them first because we lay a lot of the groundwork and we use a lot of similar techniques to prove these. Okay, so let's look at how it's stated in the question. So A, B, C, D are points on the circumference of a circle, centre O. Prove that angle A, B, C and angle A, D, C add to 180. So let's just put these points on. So A, B, C is this angle here. And A, D, C is this one. Now, how do we go about proving this? Right, as usual, we're going to prove this circle theorem by using the concepts of radius. So let's draw one from O to C, like so, and let's draw one from A to O. Now what has this created? We've now created two angles here, so there's one here and one on the other side. Now hopefully you should be able to see that we're in the situation of Circle Theorem 1, namely this angle here, let's call it X, is twice as big as the angle at the circumference, this one. So let's call this one a half x. Right. So remember in that circle theorem, if we have something like this, where this is the center, and these points touch the circumference, this angle is 2x and this angle is x. And that's what circle theorem 1 tells us. Right, where this is a circle. And similarly, this angle on the other side is twice as big as this angle here, ADC. Okay, so we're almost there now. Now, we know that X and Y are angles around a point. So angles around a point add to 360. So this tells us that, well, X plus Y equals 360. Okay. So that's good. Now, what can we do here? We're looking to show that ABC plus ADC equals 180. So we want um, ABC plus ADC to be equal to 180. But ABC is a half X, which we've just shown, and ADC is a half Y. And this is equal to, hopefully you can see from this equation here, let's call it 1, this is equal to a half x plus y, and x plus y is just 360. So it's equal to a half 360, which equals 180 degrees. So that's by equation 1 there. So what have we done? We've shown that ABC plus ADC equals 180, and that's exactly what we were trying to prove. So hopefully this makes sense. We've made use of Circle Theorem 1, so make sure you understand that. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next one. Bye-bye.